Hello friends. Welcome to Homeopathy Medicines. Today in this classic homeopathic materia medical lecture discuss about homeopathic medicine ambergrisi. By Dr. E. A. Farrington, MD. Before starting this video please subscribe to this channel. We need support from you to make this channel more beautiful and more informative. Now going to discuss about ambergrisi its uses and symptoms. Ambergrisi is supposed to be a disease product derived from the whale. It has a decided medicinal action. Like all substances having a strong odor, it acts prominently upon the nervous system. Unless there are some nervous symptoms present in a case, you can hardly expect it to do good service. Ambra affects the cerebrospinal nervous system, causing spasmodic symptoms here and there over the body. The muscles of the face twitch. It may also be used in sleeplessness arising from worriment of mind, as from business troubles. The patient may, in these cases, retire to bed feeling tolerably tired, yet so soon as the head touches the pillow he becomes wakeful. Such are cases that frequently yields to Ambra. This remedy is particularly indicated in thin, spare men, who have a decidedly nervous temperament, in whom nervousness predominates at the expense of nutrition. It is particularly indicated for the nervous complaints of old people, especially when they are forgetful and cannot remember the simplest fact. Vertigo comes on when the patient moves about, and the legs are unsteady, he totters when he walks. He has numbness of the feet and tingling in the limbs. The limbs go to sleep readily. These symptoms show you that there is either functional or organic weakness of the cerebrospinal nervous system. We may even use the drug in cases of softening of the brain and spine, whether of senile origin or not. There is another use we may make of ambergrisi. It is a very quick acting remedy. We may, therefore, give it in nervous diseases when there is defective reaction. We have already learned of a similar use of serinum, under the latter remedy, the defective reaction arises from constitutional taint. But here under ambergrisi, it arises from nervous weakness. We find many such cases, particularly among men. We may use ambra for cough, when it is worse when strangers are in the room, or under any other circumstances which would tend to excite the nervous system. It is then a cough that is reflex from mental influences. In this case, it is exactly similar to phosphorus. Ambra is also indicated for cough, whether whooping cough or not, when the cough is followed by eructation of wind from the stomach. There are not many remedies that will cure that symptom. Ambra greasy is one and the best, another is sulfuric acid and a third is veritrum album. We may use Ambra in asthma when it is accompanied by cardiac symptoms, oppression of breathing, and a feeling as of a load or lump in the left chest and fluttering in the region of the heart. This comes probably from a constrictive feeling there, not as if a hand were grasping the heart, but as though something were in the left side of the chest squeezed up in a lump. It is usually accompanied by palpitation of the heart. Embragrisi acts markedly on the female genital organs, its action here being quite important and unique. It causes a knee of the uterus. The menses are regular as to time or they come a few days too early, but they are very profuse, and are accompanied by a nosebleed and by increase in the varicose veins on the legs, that is if the patient has such a condition of the veins of the legs. There is a discharge of blood between the periods. Any little excitement or extra effort at straining at still brings on a vaginal discharge of blood, showing you how engorged is the uterus and how relaxed and weak the tissues, to permit of the soothing. The leucorrhea consists principally of mucus which has a bluish or bluish gray tinge to it, you may also use amber during lying in, especially when the constipation is severe. It is suited to those nervous women who are thin and scrawny looking, when there are great anxiety and restlessness associated with this constipation, and who have special difficulty in having a stool when the nurse or anyone else is in the room at the time. Thanks for watching this video. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon. Comment us your feedback. Like and share this video with your friends and family. For paid and free consultancy online, visit homeopathymedicines.com and mayishclinic.com. Thank you. Have a nice day. Stay healthy, stay happy.